Dream vs Dyson Is the new kid in the block going to dethrone the king of wireless vacuum? That's what we're going to find out today in this in-depth comparison. We will look at the design, cleaning performance, battery life, features, accessories and the overall value. The model we have here today are Dream's T20 and Dyson V11 Absolute Extra. Please like, share and subscribe. If you have any comments regarding this comparison, please leave a comment down below. In terms of design, both Dream T20 and Dyson V11 shares the same design language with space gray finishes, filtration system and dustbin at the top, allowing quick and easy change of brush and accessories. Dream T20 is slightly lighter at 1.7 kg and V11 weighing at 2.0 kg. The T20 is sleek and compact which makes it easier to maneuver in tight spaces and takes up less space for storage. The Dream T20 Space 4.0 motor is able to generate 150 air watt suction power, an equivalent suction pressure of 25,000 pascal. The Dyson V11, on the contrary, has a higher suction power of 185 air watt. Both vacuum can achieve maximum motor rotational speed of 125,000 rpm. Both model comes in four modes. Echo mode, medium, turbo, and auto mode, where the vacuum automatically adjusts the suction power depending on the type of surface. It is hard to pick between Dream T20 or Dyson V11 when they both do a great job in cleaning carpets, hardwood floors, and picking up different size debris. The Dyson V11 edge out in this category for its high suction power. The Dyson V11 comes in larger battery capacity of 3600 mAh with an operation time of up to 60 minutes in echo mode and takes about 4.5 hours to fully charge. The battery size of Dream T20 is 3000 mAh, has an operation time of up to 70 minutes and takes around 4 hours to fully charge. Both T20 and V11 has swappable batteries. The V11 battery can be charged separately as the charging port is located on the battery itself, while the T20 battery has to be charged with the main unit. That said, the Dream T20 comes with an integrated charging and docking station for added convenience. The Dyson V11 has a larger dustbin capacity of 0.75 liter compared to the 0.6 liter bin of T20, so you will make less trips to empty the dustbin. With V11's 14 cone cyclone system and whole machine filtration, Dyson claims to trap 99.99% of particle as small as 0.3 microns. While Dream's 12 cone cyclone separator with its 5 stage filtration system can capture up to 99.97% of the particles down to 0.3 microns. The only downside of V11 is that the brush or cleaner head will need to be removed first in order to empty the bin, which adds to a little bit of slight inconvenience. The Dream T20 has a vibrant and sharp OLED display, while the Dyson V11 has a LCD screen. Both vacuum display the current mode and they let you know if the air duct is blocked and when the filter needs to be cleaned. The T20 shows the charge remaining in percentages and the V11 shows the charge remaining as an icon and the remaining operation time in minutes and seconds. You will notice that the mode button lies below the screen for both models, which allows you to cycle through various cleaning modes. The Dream T20 has a lock button above the screen. This feature prevents finger fatigue and makes cleaning upper areas easier. At the end of the day, this is a vacuum, not a TV. As long as you can clearly see the information it's trying to convey to you, it doesn't really impact the actual cleaning process. But it is great to see that Dream is able to include a great display in its overall packages. 
Dream T20's filtration system is completely detachable individually for easy maintenance and cleaning. From the dustbin, to the pre-filter, to the HIPAA filter, and the cyclones. All the components can be easily cleaned under the sink and air dry for at least 24 hours before use. Dyson V11 is not as flexible in terms of cleaning and maintenance as its cyclone is fixed and cannot be detached. The Dream T20 and Dyson V11 comes with plenty of accessories to suit various cleaning scenarios. Both comes with an old surface roller brush, mite removal brush, crevice nozzle, and two-in-one brush. The T20 also comes with an extension hose and an integrated charging and docking station for added convenience in both cleaning and charging time. The V11 however comes with an extra soft roller cleaner head and soft and stubborn dusting brush. The T20 Smart All Surface Roller Brush has been redesigned with many new features such as V-shaped cone design and built-in anti-hair tangle clip. For in-depth overview of Dream T20, please check out our other videos in the channel. As at early 2021, Dream T20's recommended retail price is 599 Australian dollar, while the Dyson V11 Absolute Extra is 1199 Australian dollar. If you absolutely cannot compromise on the suction power and dustbin size, and you have money to burn in your pocket, then Dyson V11 is the go. On the other hand, Dream T20 offers great performance, good battery life, wide range of included accessories such as extension hose and integrated charging and docking station at just half the price of the Dyson V11 Absolute Extra. On top of the great price point, the Dream T20 offers great features not seen on the Dyson, such as detachable filtration system, OLED display with lock button, and the redesigned Smart Surface Roller Brush. If you are in the market for a wireless vacuum cleaner in 2021, the Dream T20 is highly recommended as an overall very compelling package. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share, like, and subscribe. And we will see you in the next video.